Do you know how to find the vertex of a parabola by completing the square or by simply looking at an equation? Let's take a look at, at some of the ways that we can write the equation of a parabola. y equals ax squared plus bx plus c. This is the standard form for a parabola and you've used this one a lot already. Now we can also see the equation for a parabola in what we can call vertex form. And in vertex form, it is easy to determine the vertex of the parabola because of the form of the equation. Vertex form is as follows. y equals a times x minus h squared plus k. And in this equation, h, k is the vertex, and a is the leading coefficient. It tells us whether the parabola opens up, being positive, or down, if it is negative. Now let's look at an equation in vertex form and see how we can identify the vertex and whether the parabola opens up or down. Here's an equation for a parabola already in vertex form. First, let's identify h and k because we know h and k will give us the vertex. h is 6, k is 9. The vertex of this parabola is at 6, 9. Now the leading coefficient is negative. It's a negative 3. When a leading coefficient is negative, the parabola is going to open downward. Here's another one. Notice that this equation is already in vertex form. Let's identify h and k because those are the coordinates of the vertex. The h value is 8, the k value is a positive 3. So the vertex of this parabola is at 8, 3. The leading coefficient a equals 5. 5 is positive, so our parabola is going to open upward. Can you write the equation for a parabola if you're given a, the leading coefficient is 2, and the coordinates of the vertex as 2, 3? Well, first, let's start with y. y equals a times x minus h squared plus k. Here's the vertex form of the equation. Now we can substitute the given values into this equation and write a new equation given these parameters. So we have y equals a is 2, x minus 2 squared plus 3. And here we have the vertex form of the equation for the parabola. Can you write an equation if a is negative 3 and the vertex is at 1, negative 4? Again, let's look at the standard form, the vertex form, that we were given to begin with. x minus h squared plus k. Now let's substitute the known values. y equals negative 3 times x minus 1 squared. And because this is a negative 4, we're going to add that here. Here's the vertex form for this parabola, and our work is complete.